Hello and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn, where today we are gonna be trying to get to this here cauldron and, you know, start exploring it. I don't expect we'll finish exploring it today, but we'll certainly start. Unless that is just not gonna let us in. Keep that for later. What's with the red... redness? What are... those? My focus is picking up some kind of signal. What even? Something so that these boys can uh, try to locate me? Well, their stealth generators don't like tear. I need to stop tear blasting myself. Eh. Wow, there, there's a lot of them. Um, what do they not like after they have been torn? Lightning. Okay. Also, it's got mine launchers. Let's try and remove those. Did that arrow just go through it? You're not the only ones who can drop traps. Okay, I, I need to not just be a fool who uh, tries to use a heavy attack against a thing when there are still other things about. Okay, uh, where's my shockies? There's my shockies. Need to reduce the numbers here. Okay, that's one number reduced. Buddy, can you not? Okay, we've just got you left. I see you've still got things. Okay, you've got one mine launcher. And I don't know that I can get it off very effectively. Not while you're moving around. Oh, that was my last one of those. Annoying. Stop being so mobile. Where are you weak now? You've still got your mind launcher. Yeah, trying to set a trap while the enemy is leaping at me is perhaps not my best thing I've ever tried to do. There. Jeez, why was I not just using my regular arrows before? They do so much more damage than the shockies. I don't trust you.
Does it, though? These mines sure are loud. The incredible loudness of them tells me that maybe... I mean, yeah, they do damage, but... Perhaps they're meant more as a warning system saying, Hey, don't come here. Because they're very visible and very loud. So it's entirely possible that these mines were not actually designed to kill. Despite being easily lethal. It's not to say that... It, like... Just it, from a design standpoint. It's not saying that they're not like the they are because specifically gameplay reasons, but if you think about it in universe, who designs a mine like that unless they specifically don't want people to get killed by it? Also, this is all blocked off and I don't know how to get in. Can I get in? Did I just fight all those things for nothing? Am I supposed to try and climb up on top or something? Is there some way to deactivate this later? I mean, it wouldn't surprise me if this was actually locked until later considering the things that it will likely give us the ability to control. What keeps noising at me over here? Oh, a machine. Well, that definitely answers the question of, is there anything up there? So I guess maybe we come in from the top. I mean, this path has to be here for a reason, right? Though this doesn't appear to be part of the path. Not that this looks much more path-like. Am I supposed to take this path and then go boop? Find the hidden entrance. So, there is a hidden entrance. We know this now. Also, level-wise, the place seems like it should be appropriate. Also, now that it's actually light out, we should have a slightly easier time finding entrances. It would be real nice if there was a way to get some passive healing in this game. Like, even if it got completely shut off during combat, it would still be nice. I'm a fan of passive healing in games. Because it makes it so that you don't really got to care about much between combat. So that little guy... He's all by himself up there. Was there, like, maybe a climbable spot up there, and then we jump across, and then boom? Is that the thing that I have missed? Let's get on with it. Oh, it's one of those. A red eye. Okay, probably shouldn't have walked into that. 
I don't believe there is a safe way down there from up here. I believe if I try and go down there from up here, I will become very dead. So here's... Oh, but if I fast travel, will it bring back all of the... The stealth guys? It might. I don't want that either. Um. Well, at least we can go up here. I'm actually kind of surprised that we can. Going down fast. Let's open our crafting menu. See if we can make more potions. I was supposed to craft, or not craft, buy more. I was supposed to buy more in town. But at least we can craft them. Out of fatty meat, though, so can't craft more. I thought I heard some potential fatty meat. There you go. Tag the rabbits. And you can see them, or at least see where they are through the grasses. It's handy. Tasty. I see yellow. Really? Why does Aloy refuse to grab onto most surfaces that don't have yellow? Why is there a green down there? Oh, the watcher fell. Well, it's just green. Who cares? Green from a watcher. It's not like a green from some rarer thing. That sure looks like a hidden entrance to me. So much for being careful. What did did she start sliding? Is that why she said that? Why do they make me hold to override a door? I guess in case we tried to come in here before dealing with the watcher. Also, this door being misaligned made it so that she was holding her staff up to a, a not aligned thing. Well, wasn't a whole lot on the way in, but at least we got stuff now. I want that, but I also want this. Yeah, better look out for that trench foot. So kind of them putting so much medicine right here in the beginning. Also so kind of them letting us gather that from in the water. And I 
guess. Down we go. Aha. Wait, already? I mean, yeah, I guess we're fighting a Thunder Draw and it's gonna have friends, but... Definitely the shortest cauldron. They must have really thought that a Thunder Draw was... challenge enough. Oh, cool. I've leveled up. Convenient. Might as well grab this, right? Unless... This would actually be pretty useful. We could have used it mere moments ago, really. But, yeah, I think we're gonna grab Strong Strike. And, yeah, I don't see anything else. What are these? Oh, it's just saying, hey, maybe climb this thing, dingus. So that thing we just repelled down using. That is of tribal make. That's... That's not something that's always been here. That implies that people have been here and yet not dealt with this. Um, rude. You're behind a force field. You're not supposed to do anything to me yet. You're supposed to just sit there and let me gather what I'm gonna gather, buddy. So, yeah, first order of business is gonna be getting rid of the disc launchers. And then we can use them against it. And that'll be nice and all, but... What do you want to bet we're going to have those... What are they? Stalkers? Can't be too Whatever the invisible guys are. We're probably going to be surrounded by them as soon as we deal with the power pylons. Either that or it's going to be Ravagers or some other thing that is unpleasant to deal with in multiples. Because there's no way they're going to let us deal with only a Thunderjaw. So, what do I want to do? Well, I want to have closer to maximum arrows. now. Getting our Terror Blast ready to get rid of the disc launchers. That's another hold to override, not a just press a button. Okay, why are my Terror Blasts not tearing? when they blast. That's what we want to see. Okay, 
to get rid of his other disc launcher set. He doesn't launch discs. That's why we want to get rid of both of them. They are unkind. Also, I suppose I should have my potions at the ready for more speedy healing. Yeah, now we can take another look at this. Seriously, it's... It's wooden. It's got rope and stuff, and... Aloy's waving her arms around like she's, uh... At the edge of an incredibly windy cliff. I mean, I guess it's possible that it's windy here, but we're... Indoors. Just gonna gather stuff again. Hopefully this time we won't die so quickly. Maybe I'll even be a smarty who uses uh, an HP max increasing potion before starting the big fight. Also, it looks like it actually is just the Thunderjaw. Which I guess, if we really were just level 20, would be a very intimidating thing. It, I mean, it kind of still is. It did kind of wreck us a little bit. Okay. These at the ready. That was a direct hit on there. Why did it not come off? Ow. I would love to get rid of that tail. Uh, I guess not as ow as I thought when I took the hit. Alright, not bad. Where's the other one? Way over there. Nice. And that's... Was that the tail? Nope. Okay, well... We're out of easy damage. Yeah, we got him. Got some 
not super amazing weaves, but uh, uh, they exist. Uh, your, your leg's looking a little jiggly there, buddy. Oh, my now. It's just a watcher heart. We've got 20 others. Come on, Aloy. Is this not grabbable? Rude. Making me think I can get a little bit more medicine, but it's actually not even touchable. And I don't... Oh, wait. I do see other medicine around. I'm pretty sure we're coming out of here medicine positive. Which is nice. But, uh... Yeah, why is this not grabbable? We can get right up against it. Aloy's even looking at it like... She knows it's there. But I guess those mushrooms... Uh, just have really strong willpower or something. And now I can override Thunderjaws. There you go. Information to help me override more machines. I really expected this cauldron to be longer. So yeah, now we can override the big boys. Also, we've got more stealth friends. But I'm not sticking around for them. No, what I'm doing is making my way to this. Which I guess means going here. I keep wanting it to be X to go to the place. It's never X. It's always R2. Time game. I've just warped in. I don't want to take a look at wares right now. These aren't goods. They're necessities. Come take a look. Okay, where am I going? I am going. Let's go until we hit the campfire and then move till we hit. I guess this. Why not? Don't forget to stock up before you're on the road. Nope, I'm... You'll like what I have oh. for sale, I promise. What do you mean Mount can't reach current location? Is this still too inside Meridian for a mount? I know, right? This is also medicinal. Who needs bridges? You know, I should probably toss a quick save considering what we just went through. I mean, it probably quick saved after it anyway, but... St 
still. So yeah, just follow this path until we get somewhere. The one on the left. Excuse me, other horses. I'm not here to play with you. Okay, I'm here to grab this. Um, crossing the river is n is following the path. We're full on medicine again. I can't wait to see what new and exciting thing makes that no longer true. Wow, we've got like an actual jungle here, huh? Just go. Uh, should I? I feel like if I leave these folks alone, they're just gonna get themselves killed. Um, excuse you, I was looking at your friend. I know you're basically machine raptors, but you don't gotta pull this clever girl nonsense. Go away, horses. You need to talk? Can you try and speak up above the music? that's only playing because these striders haven't decided whether or not, or not striders, these longhorns? They haven't decided whether or not to just leave. just resigned itself to its fate. Can't even see this one. But it's very much still in combat mode. There, are we done now? Sounds like there's a turkey around, but do I even care about turkeys right now? What do I care about for crafting? Turkeys. Turkeys. Fish and turkeys. I guess I do care about turkeys. Yet, I do not see any. Also, these were chargers. Which have... I think larger horns than the long horns, but I guess they're not long. So, did you have something to say, or was it just thanks? Alright, cool. Have a nice day. See you around. Where am I going? I could deal with that, but I don't think I want to on camera. I think I just want to get closer to this. Gotta go find the tall neck here in this forest. Also, let's uh, run down a fox. Running down foxes 
on horseback is a uh, very old and well-documented sport, after all. Why don't? Why did they all flash yellow for a bit there? What's their deal? Are they? They're only kind of where I want to be. I don't have to go through them. Oh no, we've discovered chickens. Bandit thugs. <laughs> My thing tells me that you are bad people and therefore you will stop being people for no reason other than that. Another signal. Don't mind me. I was just getting rid of some bandit thugs before they could get up to no good. <coughs> and then sneezing. <coughs> and then sneezing again. Where's my mount? There it is. So, let's get to this campfire. Almost ran down the rabbit. Calm, calm. A turkey. There it is. The toll neck the signal's coming from. Where it is? I need to find a way up to the toll neck's head. I mean, I certainly hear it. Oh, there it is. So, this. Also, I see this tall neck is guarded. That's not the most heavily guarded one we've ever seen. Turkey. It's guarded by a turkey. Did I loot the last turkey or did I just kill it? I don't even remember anymore. Oh well. That's gonna be it for this episode. Join us next time when we're gonna get up on top of the tall neck wherever it's gotten off to. See you then, friends.